Volkswagen Motorsport entered India almost a decade ago and since then they have managed to create an ecosystem for drivers to race professionally. It all started with the Polo Cup in 2010 and then the Polo R Cup in 2012 before it switched to the Vento Cup cars in 2015. In 2017, the two-year cycle of the Vento car came to an end and the natural successor was this, the Amio car. So in 2017, the company went back to the drawing boards and came up with the shorter wheelbase setup and came up with this monster with 205 bhp. We have Sirish Visa, Volkswagen Motorsport India's head, to tell us everything that you need to know about this car. So for 2017, however, we did something quite radical and this is what we are standing in front of. Uh, this is the Amio Cup car and it's powered by the 1.8 litre TSI engine that was also launched in the GTI in India. So along with the engine, which is uh, in the race stream, it's putting out about 205 horsepower. It's mated to a six-speed racing sequential gearbox. Uh, the reason for a sequential gearbox was the idea with this car was we wanted to bring, make this car sort of a stepping stone for drivers to go from racing in India to racing internationally. So we wanted to get a car that was cost effective but close enough so that the step from doing something like this to going to TCR was still something that was doable for most drivers. So with the 1.8 litre, 200 odd horsepower, the six-speed sequential gearbox, that would be a fantastic start. But we went on sort of added to that with the electromagnetic gear change system. So now we have a paddle change for the, this gearbox and the shifts are lightning quick. Of course, it's still paired up with the, uh, the race ABS. So that continues on. It's a safety thing for us. And in terms of driving dynamics, that was something that we actually had to work quite a lot on. Uh, the Amio shares the platform with the Polo, which is a shorter wheelbase, narrower rear track. At Volkswagen, you know, our, the characteristics that are very important for us in terms of our cars is safety, reliability and the fun to drive side of it. And with our race cars, we sort of capture and showcase all of these uh, idea, ideologies that we hold dear. So, uh, talking about the car itself, because this starts off life as a regular Amio that you or I could buy from a dealership, it has all the same safety aspects that that Amio has in terms of the integrity of the body shell. But when we start racing, we have additional demands that we put onto the race car. So to help us with that and to provide additional safety for the racers who are driving these cars, we have the roll cage that you see inside, which is welded into the chassis, which improves the rigidity of the entire car. That's the first part, the first layer of safety for our racing drivers. The second layer is in terms of the seat belt and the seat. All of these are FIA approved, which is basically uh, an international governing body for motorsport. And um, so this is what the second layer is in terms of their protection. And the third layer is what the driver is actually wearing, which is a Nomex triple layer racing suit with Nomex innerwear, which are all fire retardant. And then in addition to that, the helmet that the drivers wear also has the inner lining made out of Nomex and is designed to offer them protection in any impacts. Uh, the drivers also wear, which is a Hans device, which is something that was pioneered, the use of which was pioneered by Volkswagen Motorsport in India. It's a device that fits underneath the, the shoulder belts that connects up to the driver's helmet that keeps the driver's head from going all the way and hyperextending the neck in an impact. So the Hans device is a very critical safety aspect for us and we give that to each of the drivers when they participate in this championship because we do not take any chances at safety. And of course the final layer in terms of safety, uh, this little red box that you see over here is the brain that controls the onboard fire extinguisher. The, there's a little red tank in the back over there in the spare wheel well 
And so in case of a fire, a driver can push this red button over here and activate the onboard fire extinguisher which will then give him or her a little bit of additional time to be able to get out of a car in case of an accident. Volkswagen Motorsport India has been running the AMIO Cup in the same format with a car that has been completely developed and built with local talent at its plant in Pune. All the AMIO Cup cars are similarly speciesed so in the end, it boils down to the capability and the experience of the driver. With a mix of first-time and seasoned drivers, the program gives an equal opportunity for everyone to learn from their own and their competitors' mistake as well. And surely, gives a learning experience to all.